Have you ever wanted to take a shortcut? Hey, this is Corey, by the way. So I was thinking this morning about a time that uh, me and a couple of really good buddies, Nigel and Ralph, and they'll know who they are. Ralph actually goes by a different name now. Nigel still has the same name, but anyway, I hadn't been on this this hike before and Nigel had and we were climbing a mountain called Fisher Peak in BC and Ralph and I had this idea as we're going up I mean Nigel knew where he was going he said yeah we're going this way and Ralph and I we had, had it in our mind we're like wow this looks like a better route it looks faster looks a little more interesting we'll just we'll just cut across there kind of thing and it'd be no big deal and Nigel kept saying no no that's that's not smart I don't I don't remember exactly what he said but the idea was he said you guys are, are wrong and you're gonna, you're gonna regret it so foolishly uh, Nigel kept going the way he was going which is smart but uh, Ralph and I we we went the way we decided to go and then we ended up on the side of this mountain we're looking around we're just like Okay, well, we see where we're supposed to be going. Now what? And couldn't see Nigel. I think we were trying to yell to get his attention, you know, just like, where the hell are you kind of thing. But to no avail. So we had to, I think we essentially had to double back. So we, we retraced our steps to get back where we started on our, misadventure and then went up the way that we were supposed to go and I don't remember how we thought about it at the time we probably laughed more than anything you know we were young full of energy no big deal but uh, as pertains to the story today that's the uh, the lesson of most shortcuts quite often we try to take a faster path we're we're on one path that we we know works we've we've thought about it but then there comes a point where it's like this is too hard this this is taking too long there's there's probably a better way and then we start looking at well what's what's a shortcut here what's a hack and shortcuts and hacks work when they work but I would say that for the most part, they work for people who have already put in the work to do and to take the sure path to begin with. So then they have the experience and they know when the shortcuts apply, when the hacks, the hacking methods, when those can be used well. So something to think about as i often say have i not said that in one, any of these videos um yeah the shortcuts sometimes they end up being the longest path you can take when you when you're faced with that moment of choice where it's like man this is hard just stay the course it's 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 gonna work better than trying to veer off realize oh crap i should have just continued what i was doing it as i was doing it then you got to get back on the path and you'll end up doing more work regardless so just stick it out it might be a, a rough patch and and then it'll smooth out again and you'll have made much more progress than if you tried to find something that will work even better all right talk to you next time